What's up, no coders? Zaz here. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to create this live functioning pricing page for your Notion website within a matter of minutes using Service Spot's new styling feature. I'm so excited about this. Let's jump into it. So if you guys recall, this is actually the same template that we used last week for our functional no Notion pricing page Webflow template. Um, so I'm not going to be running through how to set up the different tiers. So instead, let's just jump into Service Spot. So once you've signed in, we are going to create a, a new pricing page. Because I don't want to go through writing out the features again, all I'm going to do is actually duplicate the pricing page that we built last week and rename it. So we're just going to find that pricing page, come here and duplicate the page. And I'm going to call this Notion for Notion. Duplicate and open that up. And you should have all the same settings as the pricing page that you created last. Perfect. Now here's the exciting part. We just released a new feature to the billing page that allows you to add CSS modifications and change your primary and hover colors for your pricing page. So this means that all we have to do is go back to our Webflow page here, copy the CSS that we added to the page settings last time, and just paste it over into our billing page. Once we've done that, we want to update our primary and hover color as well. That's looking good. I don't want to change any of the other settings, so I'm just going to save this and embed. So let's copy this code. Now we can't just copy and paste our code straight into Notion. Um, so we're going to need to host this somewhere. So for that, we are going to use HTML save. And I actually have already created a website for this or a site completely free. You just add your HTML. Let me create a new page. Go to your page settings. So let's just paste what we have. Paste that. I'm not a robot. Save HTML online. Okay, and let's click this link up here. And right away you see that it's embedded exactly how we have it on our Webflow site. Look at that, it's beautiful. But we want this to be centered, so let me just add some extra styling. Okay, awesome. So we added some HTML tags, some styling, um, and a body tag to give it a max width. Let's publish this again. Refresh our page. Awesome. Okay last piece of this entire puzzle we have to embed this now onto our notion page so just copy that go to your notion page and let me delete this guy right here now to embed you're just going to do backslash embed paste your url embed link awesome and Let's resize it to our liking. And there you have it, your functional live pricing page. Now let's test it out to see if it works properly. Go here. Okay. Awesome. And you get a success message. Now let's go back to Stripe. Go to your customers. There we have it, you guys. A working pricing page 
that you can publish to your website within a matter of minutes. And if you're looking for a custom domain for your um, Notion page, then I recommend Super. That's super.so. All right, you guys, that's it. That concludes our tutorial for today. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and let me know what you would like to see next. All right, now coders, until next time.